yourself when you have so many students and uh, not enough employees or work study hand pouring plate for oh my goodness uh, for these students every semester just becomes very arduous in your 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 daily focus is pouring plates it's not focusing on the bacteria that you need the culture or doing anything else it just getting the prosoclave and the petri with 900 <laughs> was amazing it, it's just cut out so much of time that we had to focus on pouring the plate our spring semester was cut short uh, because of the covid we just now opened a box of plates that I had made last December and there might have been 10 plates out of 500 that were bad. So when it comes to contamination, this machine is, it, it just helps so much with that and uh, it helps with the waste. We have so little waste where when we had to hand pour stuff, um, we had, oh my gosh, our place might last a semester, maybe. It's amazing how much this machine has cut out uh, contaminants and the plates are still viable after all of these months. I would cry. We would just have to adjust and kind of go back to the old ways of making the auger, putting it into the autoclave, getting it out, cooling it down, hand pouring it, you know, one plate at a time. And um, gosh, it would just be horrifying. <laughs> Whenever you're hand pouring plates, you know, you're dealing with number one, autoclave which are steam pressured um, we've had work study get burned uh, sticking their arms in the autoclave and just things happen then you talk about hot glass um, if you don't have on you know the right thickness of gloves when you're hand pouring um, we've had students uh, break the glass we've had students get burned um, all of that is just taken care of inside the propoclade. It cools it down, and then, then it, it comes over here to the Petri, Petri Swift and pours, and it just, I just can't tell you what a lifesaver it is. It 1,000%, absolutely. It's worth every penny.